One of the most paranormal things about our program is that we had continuous support from a particular group of agencies, NASA, the Army, the Air Force, for 20 years to do this group of experiments. Mm -hmm. And that in itself is paranormal. I mean, <laughs> it indicates that we all have this ability and we just have to learn what the psychic signal looks like. We sort of created a an industry. Yeah. That is, at SRI, we trained six remote viewers that we had carefully chosen from the Fort Meade group. We Who chose, was that? Uh, Hal Putoff and I chose six people, one of whom was Joe McMonagall, right. and there are a number of others who have surfaced to greater or lesser degrees. Joe has written books about his experiences, mm -hmm. so I'm comfortable talking about right. Joe. Those six then went back to Fort Meade and told dozens of people, showed dozens of people how to do remote viewing. People like Ed Day's mom, David Morehouse, who wrote a book, Courtney, like Brown. Courtney Brown. And so what can we do with this? And what, what it been? proves is that but there is more to us and more to our awareness and more experiences available to us than you would think if you just think that you're made of meat and potatoes. Hmm. And that kind of expanded awareness can lead you to learn to quiet your mind, reside in the loving space that the mystics have taught about for thousands of years, and that space is available without having to believe anything silly. It's a gift that's available to expanded awareness. Uh -huh. And that expanded awareness is what other people call consciousness. That's right. Thank you, Russell, for Very talking. happy to talk with you.